How you doing there, buddy? So, I know you perras have been out there being sucias and mañosas and everything because I have been too. So, I know how a bitch is, okay? Anyways, so for those of you who do not know me, I am restarting my, um, my TikTok. So, I am La Chola Chocha. Okay, I started off with big mouth and baby mouth and chola eyebrows and all that stuff in the Snapchat situation. And then I was like, you know what? I need to come and show people real life and stop showing this fake stuff. So I needed to be myself, you know? So I'm Chola Chocha. I'm back, bitches, for those who know I've been here. And for those who haven't and don't know me, I am here. So there you go. Chola Chocha out. Peace. Chicken grease. A few seconds in between videos so I can cut. Okay, so that's going to be the minute for the intro. Chala, chala, chala. So anyways, um, hi everybody. How are you doing? So it's me, uh, your girl's back again. La pinche chola chocha. Y'all stupid pendeja sucia perras. I know y'all out there been doing nasty shit because I've been seeing y'all's TikToks and y'all's Twitters and y'all's Instagrams and y'all's MySpace chats and your Snapchat. Oh, your Snapchats. I swear. And for those of you who want to say about my lipstick on my teeth, do not come for me because I like it. Okay. I think it brings a uh, character, not character. It brings texture to my makeup. Okay. So you just leave it alone. I don't even want to touch it. I want to put on. I get bite it. Damn. I look so good. Anyways. So, back to what I was saying. It's me, your girl, Chola Chocha, and I'm back. For those of you who don't like me, stop hating. For those of you who know me, I'm back. For those of you who don't know me, I am Chola Chocha, the nasty little sucia bitch from the corner that loves to be her authentic self, la crazy mofo, and all that stuff, okay? So, I know I come on, and I just act stupid, and I sell, and I say stupid stories, and cosas que pasan, y todo. Sometimes you might hear me speak a little Spanish. Sometimes you might speak a little le wannabe accent, because, you know, I'm an entrepreneur, and I like to speak and be everything, you know? I'm not limited to one person, because you need to stop my talents, you know? I know how to sing. I know to how to dance, to act. Act. Like, I'm a triple threat, you know? And that's all I got to say. If you don't like me, oh, well, don't watch me to the next. And if you don't like me, you know what? I ain't gonna say don't watch me go to the next. Watch me anyways because the views still make me more fabulous and more popular. So, watch me no matter what. Give me booze. Give me dislikes. Give me go to hells. Give me all that shit, baby, because I like it, okay? I do not care. I'm not one of those people who are like, oh, you know what? I wanted to be famous, and I wanted to be all this stuff, and I wanted attention, pero sabes que? I don't like the hate. Girl, bye. You want to know why? Because it's going to come to you one way or another. And if you're a stupid pendeja, sucia, mañosa, culosa que... Wants to be acting like of you're all that, but you're a santita who doesn't deserve any mala gente. Mala gente. Mm -mm. You're going to get it, okay? So, if you're not strong enough for it, don't do it. If you feel like you've been bullied, don't do it because this shit is not hard. I've gone through depression because, um, before, because, not because haters. Because I don't give a fuck about haters. But because I never became anything. Nothing ever went anywhere. And I was like, sabes que? I don't give a fuck. I'm going to do it for myself. And then I did it for myself. And then, sabes que? I got there for a second that I was going nowhere. And I went nowhere. And I was like, you know what? You got to pick your big girl panties up and just do you. You know what I'm saying? And so, aquí estoy. Otra vez, aquí estoy. So, anyways. So, like I said, this is me, Chola Chocha. And I'm back. Got my hoops. For those of you who want to get crazy, don't try me. I got my nails. Go to your trachea, straight to your throat. Don't try me. So that's all I'm saying. I got these hands. These nails will come off real quick. Don't try me. So 
Other than that, I'm a very loving person. You know, I don't like conflicts. No me gusta problemas, nada, you know. I'm not a starter of shit, but I will finish it, you know, because I will go to the toilet and take a huge shit and let you... That's all I got to say. There's some shit on my table that's distracting me. I'm sorry. I'm ADHD 4QD. What do they call it? ADHD QD? LMNOP? And don't be trying to come for me because I make fun of... I don't make fun of anything. I am. Bipolar. I think I'm bordering on schizophrenia. I got... ADH triple D. PDS double C. PDSD. And all these other syndromes that you know. I got it. So don't even try it. Don't try it. And if you don't believe me, I don't give a fuck. You can hate on me all you want. Watch my videos. Spread it out. Spread hate to try and kill me and all this stuff. Sabes que? I don't care. Too bad. Too bad. But I literally do have a lot of problems. And I just live with them and be me no matter what. Because sabes que? That's the best thing. But yes. I don't know about schizophrenia, but I know bipolarism is, is on the verge. We're in the studies for that. I know I'm dyslexic, so don't try and judge my grammar and everything. I know I'm asthmatic, diabetics, high cholesterols, high blood pressures, everything's, everything's. So don't be trying to come for me, okay? I got problems just like everybody else. Something slips, it slips, I am human, okay? Sometimes I talk shit and don't. It just comes out. Vomit of the mouth. What is it called? I don't know. I'm getting all these analogies wrong. Is that analogies? Anal allergies. Whatever. You know what I mean. You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm trying to get at. Don't try me. All I'm saying is don't try me. And if you hate me, watch me. Who cares? But I mean no harm, no hate, no anything to anybody. Okay? That's all I got to say. Nothing is malicious. Nothing is anything disrespectful to anybody. Y'all can cut. If y'all want to get so butthurt so easily because of stuff that is just triggers you for shit, that's on you. Okay? Because I'm not coming at you for any kind of disrespect or anything. If you're, you're watching my video and you're coming over here telling me to be how something to be and how to respect this and this and that as if I wasn't taught to anything or because I'm giving that off to you, that's on you. If you don't like me, I do. No me miras. Like I said, I still want you to look at me, but if you don't like it, don't look at me. It's, it's all on you. It's your fault. Damn it. It's super glue that's on here. So that shit's super strong when it comes to sticking onto my desk, pero los nails, no. So anyways, after saying all that stupid shit that was just rambling because my mind ends up going off to the elemental P's and everything and all that stuff and I start just blurting out dumb pendejadas and everything like all you stupid pendejas who do the same shit so let's get past that i wanted to come to here and start doing you know some acting stuff you know because i think i'm i'm super talented and i'm multitasked on everything you know because i can sing i can dance and i can um i'm very photogenic You know, I take real good pictures. You know? And um, so I can be a supermodel. I can be a famous singer. I used to be a video ho, you know, in those. I used to do all that. All that. Everything. Well, still do. But anyway, so now I'm going to. I I've never done acting. But I always thought I've been really good at los improvs. And I always see stupid bitches on the screen. And I'm like, mira esta pendeja. I can act way better than her. You know. You look at her going into there. I would not go into there. I don't care if it's the part. I would tell them, sabes que? I'm not a stupid pendeja. And I'm not going in the door because I know the killer's back there. And I'm not about to get slossed up. Just because ellos tan pendejos. And cree que yo, I'm going to walk in there and just get stabbed to death. No. I'm about to get my blade and start slashing up in there. Okay? So, no creo yo. No creo yo. But I know you have to do the part sometimes. But, you know, I hate when people in the movie sometimes, they're like, this is just stupid. Like, I don't, I don't even know if that's because 
the damn film directors tell them to do it, pero if they tell them to do it, tan pendejos, tan pendejos, porque they want to be in there, and they're like, they go, you know, right, they're going, and they get in the closet, right, and they close the doors. And they're there, and they're in the closet, and they're there with their knees up and everything. And they're like. <sighs> and then, uh, so that's all right, right? It's like light breathing. You're scared. You know, that, that's it's understandable. Sometimes people can control that. But then the fucking thing comes closer, right? And you start hearing. So the bitch is getting more scared. And instead of being more silent, so the motherfucking murderer and killer and beater doesn't come in to whoop the bitches ass, kill her ass, rape her ass, everything ass that they, they fucking do in the horror movies, she does this. So she goes from the... To... Like, and expect the fucking killer not to come in and start stabbing your ass and shit, you know? Like, no, pendeja. Shut that motherfucking up. Every time. Watch all the horror movies. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. Pincha hiding behind a, a fucking log and shit like this. <laughs> like, I can hear you. Pendeja, you're gonna get cut up. Sliced up, okay? Get pendeja, I swear. Mm -mm. And then the other thing that they always do. I wonder if this happens in real life because, no sé, it's always in all the movies. All the movies. Whether it be a kid, a guy, a girl, a teenager, everything. Where they want to be putting the stupid shit where they get kidnapped or they get, they get beat up or what, they're hurting their other loved ones. And then all of a sudden, they're like talking to them and shit. And... Uh. Que sucia la perra. And next thing you know, they start getting buck wild. Like, all buck and shit. Like, I'm sitting here and I'm... St oh, my nipple. <laughs> Ay, que malo. Anyway, so back to what I was saying, right? And so, I'm tied to the chair. So, I'm stuck here and everything. And they're, te they're torturing the person. Don't you dare fucking touch her. Don't you dare fucking touch her. I will kill you. Bitch, how are you going to kill anybody? Your fucking ass is tied to the chair. I'll fucking kill you, you bitch. Don't touch her. Don't touch her. And then he comes to him. Do me. Do me. And he comes to him. And next thing you know, he starts cutting him. Please. Please don't. Please don't. Stop. Please. Please stop. Didn't you just say, I fuck you up, I'll kill you, don't touch them, come to me, do me? Bitch, then he's doing you and you're crying and bitching about it. Grow some balls. Don't talk shit. Don't nothing. Stay your ass quiet and try her hardest to escape. And if you can't, take the fucking death as you can. That's all I got to say. If you can't escape and you're right there, and you're stuck in all that chair and everything, con los pinche handcuffs and the wires and everything, and all this shit, and you can't move or do anything, pues, ask you, that's you, you can't escape, take your death like a man, or a woman, or a child, or whatever you are there crying, como pendejo, and it's fine, if you're gonna be crying because you're scared, and you're everything, you're getting tortured and everything, that's fine, but don't be going and telling the killer, fuck you, fuck you, kill me, kill me. Oh, fuck you, I don't give a fuck what you do. Ah, I'll kill you, I'll fucking kill you. Ah. And then cry when that bitch stabs you. Bitch, you asked for it. You know? So let me do, before this 15 minutes is up, I'm going to do a little skit to leave it, right? Okay, I'm going to leave it on this, okay? So I'm going to show you a little bit of my acting skills. So this is a part where me, the mother, has been screwed over and deeply hurt inside by their child. And they are completely heartbroken, completely angry, completely emotional, and very, very over-the-top angry. So let me show you this. And you tell me if it's good, okay? If I make it believable. Okay, so. See. I don't understand. What have you done? Can't you see what you've done to me? I give you everything. 
everything and yet you still do wrong over and over and over there is no respect who do you think you are who do you think you are why have you done this to me That was good, right? Damn! That gives you chills. I got chills right now. You know, my hairs are standing up. Oh, I'm so good. I should be... I don't know. They need to put me in a film because I am good. I'm real good. So, anyways, well, that's it. I'm going to end the video at 16 minutes. So, I wanted to show y'all that I'm back and everything. And I wanted to show y'all that I'm going to start. Like I said, I've always wanted to act and do improv. However, I've never actually done it. So, there you go. All right, guys. So I'll see you later. Don't forget to like, comment, and to sus <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to John for ninety five for my YouTube channel. Bye, guys. Love you. Ah, these nails. Uh, they don't let me push nothing. However, they scratch everything. Bye.